Improve those flux core welds in a matter of seconds, literally. And that's because all you have to do is, well, take off the nozzle and that's it. As you're welding, there's a lot of things to think about. You got your speed, the different angles, you know, that you're going at. And one of them is the stick out. And the stick out is pretty much the wire distance that sticks out from the contact tip. You don't want it too far and you obviously don't want the tip touching your workpiece. Without the nozzle, that allows you to actually see your weld and it allows you to see that distance so much easier than with it on. You might have seen this MIG gun sitting right there. It is from my Titanium 125, which is a flux core only machine. So let's take a look. It actually comes with a flux core nozzle. Pretty much it's just a high temperature um, plastic that you thread on and all it does is just protect those threads and the ports for your MIG gas. Since that thing is a flux core only machine, really that you can do without this. This is how I actually welded for many, many years until they started coming out with these guys. So um, if you pick up the Harbor Freight uh, Chicago Electric, it does not come with one of these. It comes with an actual MIG nozzle. So you can just put that aside and, you know, weld without it. So the only time that you would actually want to keep and use this or, you know, use one of these is if you by chance have a MIG and flux core machine. If you do, then your MIG gun will have some holes in it. And that is because the gas for your MIG actually goes through your sheathing and out through those holes. So if you're flux core welding, a lot of spatter gets put out and it makes a big mess. You do want to protect these holes and these threads if you're going to be MIG welding later on or if it is a MIG machine to protect those. Trust me, these will get gummed up pretty quickly if you don't have something protecting it. In reality, a lot of your welds are going to be T-joint or fillet welds and a majority of your viewing angle is gone from your workpiece and so you have to be able to be on the side of your weld. So having the flux core nozzle or no nozzle is so much easier to be able to actually see and look at your weld puddle as you're going along. That's all I got for you, the, the no tip tip trick. No, it's a no tip tip. There you go. I'm Mech Master. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.